Well, today I basically hung out with some friends. <laughs> Pretty good day. Uh, basically, they came over earlier today and we started playing a board game called Arabian Nights. Actually, pretty good. On the box, it says it takes one to four hours, and it took us a lot longer than that because we weren't really familiar. I'd never played it before. My wife never played it before, and my two friends, they had played it before. But um, there's a lot of looking up of rules, and there's a lot of, like, you had to read this book and everything. So it took us longer than we thought it would. But we actually went out, got some sushi and hibachi grill. That's really good. I hate way too much. I think about when you eat things with a lot of rice, um, it absorbs the basically the liquid in your stomach and kind of expands more and makes you like <laughs> um, hate yourself for eating so much. And then uh, like 45 minutes later, your body like starts to digest the rice and you're like, yeah. I could eat some more. <laughs> but yeah, we talked a lot. We played uh, the Tetris Papuyo, whatever. I can't remember what it's called. But um, we played that, like all four of us together on the Switch. Oh, holy cow, is that game fun. It's like, I, I'm, the Tetris part, really good at. The other part, crap at. <laughs> Like my, my friend, one of my friends, he, he was like good at being able to make like, you get one, then it drops down, gets another, then drops it down, gets another. He's good, really good at making those combos. And I just could not get it. So like he would, so it would switch back to the Tetris part, and I'd keep doing it, getting a te getting Tetris. And um, we'd switch back to the other one, and he kept, he would think, make things combo together. And I'd be like, holy cow, it's crazy. Overall, we had a lot of fun. Uh, basically, we stopped when one of our controllers died. <laughs> That's how long we played it. But um, it's always good to actually be able to get out. We're actually like, get out, but come in and just have people over and just kind of relax and forget about things for a while. <sighs> I haven't been doing that really a lot lately. But Adrian. He really liked having them here. He talked to them and run around, played with them some. Um, but when we went out to eat, we took Adrian over to the grandparents, and he stayed there while because we went where we went to the Hibachi's Grill and everything. They do they do the fire thing with the um, the onion, that, and all the fire. I think was afraid of scaring. And also, he's not really one to sit down. He wants to run around. He'd want to talk to everybody, and yeah, it'd be qu cute and everything, but. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I don't want to be that parent that has the screaming kid in the restaurant or in the theater, things like that. So, like, we take Adrian places. It's just that in the places like that, he's not even, he's, um, not even three yet. And it's, I mean, for a kid, that's a difficult thing to sit down at a restaurant and eat. And, because, well, kids don't sit and wait that long. I mean, it's very rare you can find a kid that can sit and eat. Man, sorry. It's like after 1 a.m. I'm very tired. <laughs> but, yeah, so that's the reason why we don't really do that. Also, the reason why it's 1 a.m. when I'm doing this is because um, I've been watching Attack on Titan uh, Season 2. I watched season one when it came out. Now I've watched season two. And I got tired of waiting for the dub. So I was like, forget it. I'm just going to watch the sub. So I was, so there was like five episodes that I hadn't seen that hadn't been dubbed yet. Holy cow. I can't stop yawning. And I watched all five of them. And when it was over, I'm like, crap, I want the next episode. So yeah. It's a really good series if you don't mind blood and gore and everything it's pretty good the way things work and how things the story and the mythos of everything you're finding out things that are very interesting like it's just now getting to the point where you're like oh 
if this happens, this I'm not going to give spoilers. I'm not going to tell you that, oh, you do by the way, that blah happens, or this character does this, or maybe this character dies, or this character dies, or whatever. I'm not going to say any of that. So, and if you're wondering, oh, wait, Attack of Titan, somebody, people die all the time in Attack, in attack of Titan, uh, Attack on Titan. So, I haven't watched the junior high one. I'm not really sure if I want to watch that or not. It seems kind of weird. Gosh. Why do I keep yawning like this? Well, I don't know why. It's 1 a.m. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Doing all that was made today pretty good. I actually really like today. And I've been sitting here talking for a lot longer than I thought I had. Um, but... Adrian, when he woke up this morning, and people say, oh, he woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Adrian woke up on the wrong side of the bed. He got up and he just cried. He didn't want to eat. He didn't want to change his diaper. Gosh, why am I yawning so much? Why, why do I keep asking why am I yawning? I know why I'm yawning. I've already said that. <laughs> but, yeah, so, he... Basically, when we got downstairs, he wanted to lay on me. Well, he cried. He didn't want to lay on me. So I took, I stood him on the, so I let stand stood him up. Then he wanted to lay on me. Uh, he didn't want anything to drink. But then, so I fixed him something to drink. He didn't want it. So I set it down on the table. He whined because he wanted it. He, he went over and got, and I'm like, all right. So I just like, all right, just sit there. You'll calm down and figure out what you want because sitting there just randomly grabbing stuff like here try this here try no I, I don't know what the average parent does in that situation but at that point I'm just like maybe it's better just to let him whine because what it is is he woke up before he was ready and he's just tired so I was like alright Go ahead and whine, do whatever you want. And then my two friends got here and he kept doing it. It's like, what's going on? He does and normally he does he 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 might do that for 10, 15 minutes after he wakes up, but this time it's just like for like an hour. And I was like, okay, does he feel sick or something? Check his temperature. No. It's just being a little turd. <laughs> but yeah, then um after about an hour, hour and a half, he calmed down and started playing and doing everything. We took him over to his grandparents and he played over there. Just weird. Mm. Whew. It's about 400 to yawn. Did you, have you been yawning in this video? Because I have. <laughs> Those things, yawns are, yawns catch. Or sorry, your yawns are contagious. Never really understood that, but maybe it's true. Let me know. Did you yawn a bunch of times during this video? Tell me. But anyways, I'm in here. I had a pretty good day. Played board games, played video games, hung out with some friends, had some good food. Can't really beat that. But hope you had a good day. Talk to you tomorrow.